How to enable Facebook Marketplace notifications. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimo from App Guide, and in today's guide video, I'm about to simply show you how you can actually enable Facebook Marketplace notifications on your Facebook app or on your device. But before we get started with this video, if you are new to our channel, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and without any further ado, let us get started with today's video. Now before we try to get on to how we can actually enable Facebook Marketplace, if you don't know what Marketplace is, then it is simply a feature on Facebook app itself where you can actually buy and sell items locally or ship. You could actually rent a house, you could actually also search for rooms, you could sell your products, you could showcase your products, you could also turn your business and then actually promote your business in any way. And if you're actually trying to sell some products and you've not been receiving the notifications for the messages which you have received, in this video I'm about to simply show you how you can enable those notifications so make sure to watch this video till the end first things first you simply want to make sure that you have actually updated the Facebook app to the latest version in order to avoid any type of bugs during the notifications process you want to make sure you are always using the up-to-date version of Facebook once you've made sure you've updated Facebook I'm going to simply open it and the very next thing you want to make sure is that you are logged into your account basically first of all I'm going to show you the marketplace section you can see people are actually trying to sell products and so many more options if you also want to sell then you could basically simply tap on the sell option and then try to sell items vehicles or homes for sale or rent and if you actually want to enable notifications what we can do is from the top right hand side you'll be able to see this three lines icon now bear in mind that if you're using it on iphone or ios this option could be at the bottom right hand side of the screen but anyway you want to actually click on this icon which looks similar to this once you actually go to the menu icon you want to scroll down to the bottom until you find the option called settings and privacy tap on settings and privacy followed by the settings option at the top of the screen again once you go to settings you'll be taken to your settings and privacy page where you basically have the option to actually customize many things but what we can do is under the preferences tab right here in the third option you'll find a button in the bell icon which says notifications and that is exactly where we want to go we want to simply go to the notifications tab once you go to notifications you have the option to customize all of the notifications you receive on facebook such as comments tags reminders activities updates friend requests of people you may know birthdays groups and so much more here you want to look for the option called marketplace and right at the bottom at the third last option you'll find a button which says marketplace now you should also keep in mind that this option could vary depending on the update and depending upon the time when you're watching this video but you simply want to look for the option called marketplace and tap on it once you tap on marketplace you can simply turn this toggle on which says allow notifications on facebook once you turn this toggle on it is actually going to be highlighted in blue at the bottom you can also customize where you receive these notifications such as push or email or sms and you can also see these settings will not impact the notifications that other page admins receive once you've actually turned on this notification, you'll receive all of the updates about the products which you're trying to sell on the Facebook Marketplace community. We hope this video was really helpful and if it did help you, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you have any more questions, queries or doubts, simply also make sure to leave them down in the comment section. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon in our next video.